Thanks, Kurt. And my third and final pick of the handicapping contest is in here. 25 to win in place on ultimate long shot. Starters for the Milton Downey rolling in behind the turn. From the rail out, we have Girl in a Tavern with Jason Hughes. Ultimate long shot, Dave Dowling. Elm Grove Quest, Brody McPhee. The Real Princess, Corey McPherson. Woodmere Jazz with Mark Hag outside. Casey Starlight, Stephen Trites. Steak time at Exhibition Park, Milton Downey Memorial. Here they come. There they go, off and pacing. The real princess fires from the outside. She's looking into the turn from the inside. Girl in a tavern. These two into the first turn. Girl in a tavern. First one in on the outside. The real princess looking for a seat. That's currently occupied by ultimate long shot. The battle's still brewing as they come out of the first turn. It's girl in a tavern on top. She's the leader. Outside the real princess. So far getting the cold shoulder. Ultimate long shot studying these things from third. Back to fourth, we have Woodmere Jazz by the opening quarter, 27 and three, and it is serious up front. Girl in the tavern, putting the cold shoulder to the real princess. Ultimate long shot, loving the trip in third. So is Woodmere Jazz right there fourth. Gapped out a bit, that's Elm Grove Quest, and at the back, Casey Starlight is underway. Things are still battling here halfway home this is girl in a tavern she's the leader halfway home for the blue knight she took them there 56 and 4 girl in a tavern halfway home the real princess outside getting the going the long mile great trip for Woodmere Jazz. She's second over and spotted well. No place to race right now for ultimate long shot. They roll by five eights down the back stretch. Girl in a tavern. Looks like she's got them all where she wants them right now. Three wide move. Here comes Woodmere Jazz from the back. The real princess going a big one in the center. They race to three quarters. It's still girl in a tavern. 127 and three. The fractions have been serious. Real princess on the outside. How much longer can she take? Ultimate long shot no place to race in the pocket Woodmere Jazz she's ready to come wide again and still Casey Starlight top of the stretch girl in a tavern she's got the lead and control through the stretch girl in a tavern ultimate long shots trying to come up the cones far outside the real princess is still there it's girl in a tavern ultimate long shot one last try girl in a tavern found the line then ultimate long shot was second close for third time for the mile 159 and 3. Yeah, wow, what a mile. Two year old pacing Phillies, and they were at it, and they were at it early. And Girl in a Tavern wanted the lead. 27 and 3 gave the park job to Corey McPherson. David Dowling had all the holes filled there. And uh, Girl in a Tavern did all the work on the front end. Never relinquish the lead whatsoever. And the opening quarter, 27 and 3, the half 56 and 4. And again, Corey McPherson getting the worst of this one with the real princess getting parked. But boy, she was game. And ultimate long shot. There you see her up the inside trying to get up late to call her jason through the home stretch but you got to give it up to girl in a tavern doing all the work on the front end and ultimate long shot gets up for the deuce on the inside and fast closing was woodmere jazz coming on late and in between them the real princess but uh, what a trip did all the work girl in a tavern cut that fraction 56 and four over the half 127 and three at the three quarters and the two-year-old Phillies, they were rough flying here today. And it's Girl in a Tavern back to the winner circle in just a few moments here. A well-earned victory in the Milton Downey two-year-old Philly division worth $9,000. Congratulations to all involved. Girl in a Tavern, hard-earned win here in race four. Now making their way back 
In front of the grandstand comes the winner of the first division of the Milton Downey Memorial. This one for two-year-old pacing fillies. It's the one entry girl in a tavern. She is a two-year-old filly by Big Jim from the Cam's Card Shark Mare Drinking Games. She's owned by Donald McRae of Vernon Bridge, Prince Edward Island, trained and driven by the Blue Knight Jason Hughes. She, he put Girl on Tavern on top all the way toward fractions, but he had control of the racetrack. Girl in a Tavern, that's win number seven from 10 tries this year. Pushes her career earnings to over $27,000. Congratulations to the connections, Don McRae, Jason Hughes, and Girl in a Tavern.